There's a... Nico, give me a hug! Good to have you here, cousin! I've got something for you! Oh, damn! Damn, damn, damn! Uh, yes, Vlad! It's sorry! No, forgive me, okay? No, no, please don't cut my cock off! Uh, okay, Vlad! Yes? Uh, uh, okay. Thank you. This is the woman that I'm going to marry. <laughs> Whatever you say. I thought you were going to marry me, baby. Hey, Brad. Hey, Brad. <laughs> Great. You're fucking crazy, man. <laughs> you should lose few pounds. Otherwise, this beautiful lady is going to lose. <laughs> uh, no, I'm a fat prick. What did I do? Uh, pay you uh, dance? I will, I will do, man. We spoke of this. No, we didn't speak. You spoke. Then you say your phone out of batteries. You treat me like a bitch. Never. I treat you like an idiot, not a bitch, huh? <laughs> I guess it's true. The beautiful woman do like the guys with a funny sense of humor. Mm -hmm. Ho ho! I'm laughing. <laughs> I'll get you the money. I know. And Roman, tell this fucking yokel here if he doesn't stop staring at me, I'll have his head chopped off and put a film of it on the internet! Ouch. Ah. Oh, good. Great. <laughs> yeah, fantastic. <laughs> Look, say what you like, but at least that guy knows how to speak to a lady. Yes, he's all charm. Come on, Nico, let's go. Come on, Hattie. Forget about the fat sir. Vlad, shut up. But he's a serf, and you're a countess. Uh, talking about serfs. Oh, hey, Nico. Where's Roman? <laughs> Good question. Hey, Yoko, your dumb cousin isn't here. Go get me a coffee. What? Get me a fucking coffee! Come on, I'll get you one. What? You keep staring at me. I'll burst one of your eyeballs. Gorgeous, this guy's a fucking creep. Give him a break. He's new in the country. I can see that. Did you walk here from 1985? Yeah. Excellent. Now stop fucking staring at me. I mean, I know I'm good looking and everything, but come on. Uh, hey, Mallory. Hey, man. Hey. <laughs> About time. Vlad, Vladdy boy, what's going on? Roman, Roman boy, you tell me what's going on. Nice aftershave, what is that, sex pest? No, <laughs> it's where is my fucking money? I, I had it, I, I had some of it. Then those Albanians you said you would deal with came and smashed my computer! So it's my fault? I, I didn't say that. Good. Anyway, Nico dealt with him. Broke Darden's arm, then beat up a couple more. Then we teach him a real lesson. <laughs> Is that so? I tell you what. While you don't pay, maybe you and Nico can do me few favors. Sure! <laughs> Good. Why not? Later, Vlad. Vlad, uh, name doesn't ring any bells. I'm sorry. You better start remembering important people, you dumb peasant. Hey, baby. Your cousin owes me a lot of money. If you don't want to make things real difficult for him, you are going to come to Kamrat Bar in Mohawk. I have a word for you. Ah, uh, fuck you! You're a bunch of pussies and fags! Nice. I'm going back to the meeting! Good. I'm going to be somebody! Yeah, yeah. See you later, Mel. You always were an asshole, Mickey! Hey, watch where you're going! Hey! Hey! I tried to tell you... Fuck to... you! Excuse me. What's my name, Mickey? So, Ivan, I see you later, okay? Yoko, Fetty Roman's cousin. What's your name again? Big Mouth Prick. Very catchy. Sit down. Cousin... Uh, Nico. That's it, Nico. Not Big Mouth Prick. You funny guy. I try. Yes, and this one's. I'll let you take the shit out of him. Take the shit? Yes, Mickey about. I don't understand. Ah, people who fuck with me, get fucked with! Okay, fine. Calm down. Whatever. Some old man not paid me in months. And I'm not kind of person who is treated this way. Old bastard owns a china shop in the Camden Avenue in Dukes. Here you go. Don't hurt him. Just teach him a lesson. I don't need a bat to teach a lesson.
Hey, Yokel, you managed to do the job? Get Vlad his money? He paid up. I had to smash the shop up pretty good, but he paid. Don't worry your little peasant head about it. Stupid jerk made a mistake of telling me how much he gets that shit for back east. He's the biggest crook in the neighborhood. Lucky I don't tell his customers what they're paying for. That it? Can I go now? Sure. Get out of my face. You're going to have your license revoked. What? My friend, smoking in a bar is a crime, plain and simple. Well, you're joking, right? This is a joke. Yeah, you're playing hey, a joke on me. Mallory, right? tell Fadig his cousin is okay. He just walked in. Great girl. Yeah? Stay away from her. Of course. Now listen, you did good with the business they added. But now one more peasant is trying to avoid pain. Who? Moskovsky jerk who owns the laundry in the Masterson Street. Thinks in this country business is done differently. Says he will call cops on us. Okay. So? The jerk needs to be taught a lesson. Give him a bit. Let him know might is right. Hey! Stop that smoking back there! Bushel! Easy, Wait. buddy. Go on. Do what you gotta do. But remember, you see a cop? You don't know me. I see anyone, I don't know you. Ho, ho. Hello. Love, говори. Да, да. Что ты хочешь? Быстрее, я очень занят. I spoke to the laundry mat owner. He gets the message. He will pay you now. I like your style. You can be an intimidating guy. It's a shame everybody knows what a stupid yokel you are when you open your mouth. Huh? Come back to the bar soon. So she sends me out to the store, and I walk out of the house. Hey, Frank, let me out of the house. Where can I get some? Oh, Yoko, there you are. Okay. Glad. Come on, let's go for a walk, okay? Right. Okay, come on. I don't even like this. Where are we going? To my car. Why? Because of your cousin. What? Owe me a lot of money, and until he pays me, you're fresh off the boat. Excuse yeah, me. Ass is mine. What the fuck you mean, why? Hey, you are a pretty relaxed guy, huh, Vlad? Come on. Bonavince, start a wage mark. Come on, Yoko. What's wrong with you? You gonna Watch jump it, me? Dude. No, I had a late night last night. Spent yeah. it with Mikhail. I don't know what Great. You know. Yeah, wild. <laughs> yeah, I guess you're right. That's so who the hell one. is Mikhail? Hey, Mikhail's a man. Shit, my nose is bleeding. Is my nose bleeding? No, not yet. Fuck this. Come on! Wait! I'm walking hey, here! Wait the Let's fuck go! Up. Damn city, always trying to run you down, huh? Hey man, can I Get that job, hey, you deadbeat crackhead! Just a little change, man! Uh, man, hey, where do these whoa, people whoa, get off? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Like I'm gonna pay for their drug habit. Well, say something! You are so fucking laid back! Warren! Come on! Want some? Good. We walked all the way over here so you could snort coke? No, listen! Ah, uh, that's better. Huh? That's better. Man, Michael gets the good stuff. It's a got some laxative in it, though. Keeps your stomach problem. <laughs> nice detail. Yeah, listen, uh, where were we? I don't know. Oh, yeah. So, I need you to head up to Duke's and get a car for me. It's a silver blister, and it's packed in the projects by EIC subway station, okay? Sure. <laughs> you got keys? Uh, no, Yokel. I need you to take the car. Asko owes Mikhail some money. Take his car instead, huh? We gonna <laughs> drive over there? What? Are we gonna drive over there? No. You're gonna take the train, buddy. You think I wanna be in the car with the peasant? Come on. I'm gonna go meet somebody. <laughs> Have a little <Okay>. party. <laughs> Fine. <laughs> Have bye, fun, dickhead. I have your new car, Vlad. It's not pretty, though. Real dirty. Dirty? I can't sell a dirty car. I know your cousins like them dirty. Maybe your whole yokel family drives around in the dirty cars, but it's not the way over here. Fucking peasants don't do nothing right. Hey, I could fuck this car up worse than a little dirt. Relax, man. 
You should lose your age. There is a car wash over on Saratoga Avenue. Just take it over there, and then to my lockup, just of Mohawk. Did they give the car up easy? He's a little bruised, but he gave it up easy enough. Good. Dead guys can't pay interest. You are learning. I put the car in your locker. You're not as stupid as you look, Yoko. Come back to see me at the parcel. Hey, Yoko, what the fuck? That car you got to me, it looks like shit. I got a hot day tonight. Too bad, man. It was clean, wasn't it? Well, maybe you should stay home. Goodbye. Hey, Mickey. What do you have? Glass of water. Glass of water. Bang, bang, you are dead. Wake up, you moron. You got me. Come over here. Sit down. You remember Ivan? No. The guy you saw me talking to. This guy. This guy. Oh, yes. You guys had the little kiss. Very funny. What would you say if I told you he was going to rob your cousin? I'd say, what problem has he got with my cousin? Hold on. Hey, 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 gorgeous. No, I can't talk right now. What are you wearing? No, I mean underneath it. Great. Listen, I'll call you back, huh? Sorry. Who was that? Never you mind. Was it Ivan? Ooh, that's funny. You know, for a dumb yokel, you're a very funny guy. <laughs> <laughs> yes, and for an annoying dick, you're really an annoying dick. Well, it's a real shame then that I'm the guy with the powerful friends, and you're the little punk whose only friends is some fat weasel who draws the fucking cap! So, why is Ivan going to rob my cousin? Because I want you to kill him. What? He's angry at Mikhail, Mr. Pause. Offended him. He think he's stealing some paperwork from her mom. You catch him and kill him. Then we say it was just a robbery that failed. And what if I say I don't want to be your hitman? <laughs> that Mr. Faustin will be very angry with you. And your cousin. Hmm. Okay. I knew we would understand each other once I put it in this simple way. Now, go wait for him by the car depot. Hey, gorgeous. Yeah, where were we? Okay, now listen. Let's talk about it. You won't be seeing your boyfriend Ivan no more. Oh, are you going to miss him? No, I'm not. I'm getting enough pussy at the moment. I tell you, it's so much better if women already have a man, because you don't have to deal with all this shit all day. Take Mallory, for example. Fuck you! You say this to my face and I will break you! Hey, what's wrong? Hey, cousin. Bullshit. What's bullshit? Mallory. Oh, what about her? I like her. I really like her. But you keep messing around with other women. Yeah. No. I think she's messing around with Vlad. I, I saw his car parked outside her place the other day. Yeah. You knew? I had suspicions. You fucking knew? What was I going to say? You knew my woman was banging this war dog and you didn't do anything? I didn't, you didn't say anything? I didn't know. You're an asshole, Nikobelik! A disloyal user! After what I did for you, you dick! You fucking dick! I'm sorry! Screw you! All right, so you want me to deal with it right now? No. Sit down. No! I'm not going to stand here and have you call me disloyal. You might let some Russian asswipe bang your woman, but I won't. 
But you fucking did! That was before I knew you cared! You always were a hypocrite. Nico, wait! Don't do anything stupid! Wait for me! Tell me you're just blowing off some steam. You're, you're going for a little drive. You're going to leave Vlad alone, right? Cousin, this is crazy. We got each other. We don't need women in our lives. I'm getting tired of Mallory. She's too old for me anyway. You have been pushed around too much, Roman. You let these people use you. Use me. They will not use Mallory as well. She is too good for them. She's too good for me. Vlad should have her. I will show Vladdy what he can have. Wait, Nico, you have to think this through. Stay out here. Let the big boys have their conversation inside. Give me three. Anyway, I tell you, про капусту. Зачем нужно жрать капусту, если есть картошка? Эй, картошка! Bloody boy! I'd like a word with you. What are you doing here? Did I summon you? Why? I told you to stay away from Mallory. Ah, go away! And now Roman is upset. Oh, Roman is upset. Excuse me. Do you think I give a fuck, peasant? Oh, there he is. Hey, Fatty. I'm so sorry you're so upset. Oh, poor fucking ho. <laughs> hey, Vlad, can't oh, we no. just talk about this? <laughs> you stay away from Mallory. I must be hearing things. I could have sworn for a minute this ratty little yokel told me what to do. <laughs> Did you hear that, boy? Yeah. Now, get them out of come here. On, come on, come on. Get back outside, Rob. <laughs> He's going to stay away from Mallory for sure. I am not done with Vladdy yet. Not even nearly am I done with him. Come on, Nico, this is stupid. All for a woman? We should not throw everything away for one girl. This is principle. We do this because we will not be stepped upon. By doing nothing, we let Vlad take everything from us. He takes our pride, Roman. Pride? Pride? Who needs this? We do. If we are to live with ourselves in this city, Vlad shall soon understand that. Shit, I don't like this. Keep your head down. I'm going to finish this. Stop! Nico! Shit! Fucking Yokel! You think you can get away with killing me? I guess I'll find out! You think this is worth it? You are throwing you and your fatty cousin's lives away for that bit of Puerto Rican chocha! I'm throwing your life away, prick! We'll do all right! My friends will track you down! You won't last a moment! I'll last longer than you will, shithead! Fuck you! I wish I could be there to watch Mikhail cut your peasant balls off! You've killed yourself and your cousin, Yokel. You are dead man. Half Beach is a small place. My friends will find you. You were the stupid one, Vladdy boy. Nobody fucks with my family. You're a big boy, Vladdy. Nico! Nico! Uh, well, I guess this is over. What have you done? What does it look like? We're dead! No, he's dead. We're fine. He has powerful friends. Serious people. I told you to be calm! You halted the jump! I am calm. He tried to kill us. He screwed your girlfriend. What do you expect? I give him a massage? Shit! 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 When I was in the army, we were going on a mission to ambush a squad who had killed a lot of innocent people. They were our enemies, but we never did it. 
There were 15 of us, all boys from the village. But one of us betrayed the group. It was a setup. For money. Twelve people died. Three escaped. I know the traitor was not me. So for ten years, I've been searching for the other two. One of them leaves here. Why are you telling me this now? Do you always get sentimental after you kill people? You kept asking. Wonderful! You're here on some revenge mission for something that happened ten years ago, and you don't care whose life you ruin anyway. No! Well, what? I don't know. I just want to know why they did it. Well, right now, I don't think you're going to find out. Let's hide the body, at least for a while. Put him in the river. If he'll fast, he's going to kill us. Shit. We should get out of here. You go. I'll catch up with you later. Huh? <sighs> 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 <sighs>